going to dedicate this to my Uncle Morty, who, like me, suffered from bipolar depression, and my Aunt Dumb, who sadly, despite a lot of love and many years, was not able to stop the inexorable slide into despair that caused my Uncle Morty to take his own life. Tell me years later, when I was headed down the same road of isolation, stepped in and saved my life. So this is for them. It's called Break the Silence, Bring Down the Stigma. I'm choosing to break the silence because I've learned firsthand that the stigma of depression is a box built on four S's. Shame, secrecy, silence, and separation. And when the separation becomes so extreme, like it did for my Uncle Morty, then the box becomes a casting. Mm -hmm. This is a light for Morty, for all the lives lost. It's also a light for the lives saved, and for you, Thelma, and for all of you who at different moments have had to face the depths of your own despair, have had to dig down deep into the darkness and discover a spark of light, a little glint of hope that gives us the strength to break the silence and to stand together and when we join forces, one light can ignite a whole bunch of others. It's a miracle. The second night of Hanukkah in December. <laughs> Told you I was going to change my name to Menorah. <laughs> now we turn to our regularly scheduled program. In many ways, it sometimes feels like it would take a miracle to dismantle the stigma of depression. All the stereotypes, all the taboos that confine us, lock us into little boxes. It's a tall order. One that to pull off seems like it would take nothing short of sheer magic. But it turns out that when you have people who you can count on, people who stay with you and believe you and hang with you no matter what, it gives you such a solid base of community, such an interconnected people's network, that when you're able to place your faith in something that solid, it turns out you don't have to really believe in magic. Because the real magic is in believing. To quote the writer Carl Mays, sometimes it's only when we can see the invisible that we can do the impossible. I will now swallow the box. <laughs> It's like levity. It helps heavy spirits rise. And if you can all help me rise to the occasion of ending this with a little finger popping rhythm, for those balancing act, break the silence, bring down the stigma, and beat the blues.